DJ Moore, he's a true number one, right? He can play all over the place. He's got deep threat ability. He's got yards after the catch ability. He's very good in the intermediate part of the field in terms of getting open. And you can play him on the outside. You can play him on the inside. Um, you can do a lot of things with DJ Moore, and that's going to really, I think, help Getsy in this offense in terms of formulating a coherent passing attack. Because last year, it, it seems like he they really did not know how to put together a consistent, you know, passing offense to kind of complement off of the run game. And this year, I think you can do a lot more um, with a guy like DJ Moore who can get open in all three areas of the field. Now, I think Darnell Mooney is a perfect complement to Moore as well because he's a guy who is versatile in the way that you can align him as well. You can line him in a slot. You can align him on the outside. And he's got that speed to be a deep threat, but he's also shifty enough to where um, he can run routes and get open in the intermediate part of the field as well. So, again, you have two wide receivers that are versatile and flexible that can get open at all three areas of the field. Now, DJ Morris brings more of a size component than – um, Mooney does obviously when he's on the smaller side for wide receivers, but it, it can still work that way either way. And then Claypool is kind of like the a pure outside receiver who's going to add some as a blocker in this offense, I think, on the outside. And he's just a big guy on the outside. You're going to run goal balls with him, you're going to run uh, deep digs with him, uh, maybe get the ball on the screen once in a while to use his size and. Um, use him for jump ball situations. Like he, he's purely there just to add, add that, you know, outside physical dimension to this offense.